Hello you guys, it's Anna here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Today I am going to be doing a different kind of video. I'm going to be showing you guys my art supplies haul. All the things that I recently collected from YesStyle as well as a mini paint with me at the end to kind of demonstrate uh, the new watercolor set that I got and I'm super excited. I'm usually typically showing you guys like thrifted fashion, you know, clothes and stuff. So this time it's a little different. So as you guys may or may not know, I have been starting to paint and just kind of go through this different artistic process and I've just been really enjoying it. So if you guys want to catch my first painting video, I will link it up in the cards in case you have missed it. Um, but yeah, we're just going to get into, I guess, like the art supplies of what I recently got. So this is the first thing. It's just this acrylic color painting set. Comes with a paintbrush and 12 different colors. Um, this is quite small, so I wanted to show you my hand for reference. The tubes are small, so just keep that in mind, FYI. I'll probably do like a demonstration in another video because I'm still exploring, you know, the different avenues of painting. And the next thing that I grabbed are these wonderful flower press stickers. They're obviously not real flowers, but it looks like it's real and it's super, super pretty. Um, the quality is also really great and then the next thing that I grabbed is this painting set so this is a watercolor painting set and it comes with 18 different colors and it actually comes with a lot of different things I like the fact that it came in this package because this is super useful especially if you are new to watercolor painting And then the next thing that I grabbed is this travel case um, because I do plan on traveling and I think this would be like super useful and easy for me to kind of like bring on the go. It's super compact and has so much different compartments for everything that I need and this also has another side to this bag so you can just carry a lot more things. I feel very professional. And then the next thing that I grabbed is this plastic painting tray, which will be definitely useful for my future paints. This one's my favorite. I love using washi tapes for like journaling or even when I'm painting. If I want to paint like four different pictures on like one piece of paper, I will separate it using these washi tapes. And I love the look of them. Um, I just place them on this blank piece of paper just to kind of show you guys for reference. And they're so pretty and the quality is actually really Really great. Um, I'm actually quite surprised for YesStyle. Um, they have a lot of different options for like different designs and artworks for the washi tape so I highly recommend them. And then the final thing that I grabbed from YesStyle is actually these this beautiful wooden paintbrush set. So I'm like super excited to use them. I feel very professional with this and especially even like the bag that it comes in. So these are all 24 different types of paintbrushes for different uses and I'm still learning and exploring that so I haven't quite used them yet but I do find that the quality is great um, and just one thing to note is that the brushes are fairly stiff. It kind of feels like you have to like break into them before you use them. Kind of like I have to break into a brand new pair of like boots. So this is the fun part. I get to paint and I want you guys to paint with me like we're painting together. Um, I am using this notebook from YesStyle as well and I guess the whole idea of what was inspiring me was this flower press art and I thought it'd be really cool to add them into the painting so I thought about kind of doing like painting like a bouquet and putting it into a cute vase and that was sort of like my inspiration behind this picture. So I am pretty much just kind of doing this all freehand. There's no like picture that I'm following it by, just kind of going by how I'm feeling. And I'm just using four different colors, a pink shade, green, yellow, and white. Um, I do find them that they're really easy to mix. And so for this like pink blush color, I did mix the yellow and the um, pink together to get this lighter blush pink color. And so I'm just painting the vase. I wanted to start off with that just so I could fill in everything else after. Okay. 
and then this is like the fun part just kind of filling in the space and just drawing some flowers and adding some vines to it I'm starting to get a sense of what I've been really drawn towards and it's definitely nature um, I still want to explore different avenues as well and this isn't actually my first time using watercolor and I am absolutely loving the process guys like seriously I, I love how organic it is how the paint kind of runs through the water and it just kind of places itself and I love that organic process when it comes to watercolor painting I'm basically just shading in the vase I'm still working on my shadow work um, and then I added like a bunch of paisley prints to it I just I love paisley and that's just something I'm just drawn towards too and I just try to complement like the colors around uh, this flower so that was pretty much the idea behind this um, very simple but really fun and creative and I do encourage you guys to Pick up a paintbrush and it doesn't have to be like the most fanciest equipment. Just kind of go and have fun with the process. The most important thing is for you to enjoy yourself and for you to just really let go and kind of tap into that creative side that you've always wanted to tap into. So that is it for my video. I hope you guys enjoy. Um, feel free to follow me at my Instagram at there she goes YT, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye!